Unbound is an international aid charity based in Kansas City. Their largest Facebook audience is people ages 25 to 34. A look at today's Facebook donation campaigns. We have people from all over the United States who are, and even the world. Forgiving Tuesday is impressive, a seemingly endless scroll. The charity and the families they serve are grateful, but. The important thing is to keep showing up. Don't make it one day, but keep showing up. The majority of Unbound's funding comes from sponsoring a child, elder, or family, so the subscription-style giving is built in. $40 a month or $480 per year. That's 85% of their donors. You've probably seen more and more charities doing it, taking a bank account number or a credit card number, making it kind of like these subscription TV services. But there is a different timeline that you can use. For example, Netflix comes out once a month, Amazon Prime comes out once a year. The folks at Unbound say more and more people are asking for their donations to come out annually. And on auto pay, they say that's actually better for them. So that cuts down on processing fees. It cuts down on the amount of time that we have to spend processing the different transactions. Speaking of Amazon, you've probably heard of Amazon Smile. You can buy stuff and then a portion of what you spend goes to a charity. Sounds simple enough, but know that the charity only gets one half of 1%. So for example, this ring doorbell I got on special for $100, the proceeds for the charity are just 50 cents. Thousands of dollars from thousands of people all over the country. So the best option is always to give direct through the charity's website. Another local charity with international outreach is Heart to Heart. We followed them on numerous disaster relief trips. Their experience is similar to what research shows. Older folks send checks in higher dollar amounts. Younger folks donate electronically in smaller amounts. But it's not hurting the bottom line because... Overall, companies are giving more and baby boomers are giving more, and, and millennials are giving. She says some might see smaller donations, but the takeaway people miss about millennials is where charitable giving fits in their hearts. But it's becoming a core part of their values and who they are, both as individuals and as families. And that bodes well for the future. Betsy Webster, KCTV5 News.